हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक टू माय चैनल कोड फॉर किड्स तो प्लीज लाइक शेयर एंड सब्सक्राइब आवर चैनल एंड प्रेस द बेल आइकन टू गेट मोर लेटेस्ट अपडेट ओके सो टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न अबाउट द ड्रेस अप तेरा ओके सो इन दिस प्रोजेक्ट फर्स्ट आई विल रन दिस प्रोजेक्ट आई विल शो यू ओके so by using this flag we can run our project now see suppose you want to wear this dress so what you can do you need to just click here see after that suppose you want the hat okay now see mm. okay you want this color you want to wear the pants okay so whatever you want you need to just click on that and you will get everything here okay so this is our today's project so now let's see how we will create this project okay so now we will start so for that what you need to do you need to take a new file okay so how we can take a new file now you already know you need to just click on file new so here we will get one new project okay now what is the next thing we can delete this project this sprite okay so what we will do now we will delete this sprite after that so first thing always you need to add some backdrop if you want any colorful background if you want any picture you need to just click on this choose a backdrop after that whatever backdrop you want suppose you want this castle fort you need to just click on that see you will get that backdrop here after that whatever sprite you want means whatever characters you want how you will add that character you need to just click on this choose a sprite that you will search what sprite you want okay suppose in the people we will get all our sprites okay so first we will scroll down whatever sprite you want you need to just click on that okay suppose i want this fairy so you need to just click on the fairy see okay now what next sprite you want suppose you want some glasses or whatever you want you need to just search for that suppose i want this glass okay after that you can put this here or anywhere whatever position you want for that glass okay after that you can add some more glasses so this is my sunglass one suppose i want this sunglass here and this sunglass okay after that what you want to add suppose i want to add some wings so we don't have that suppose i want this butterfly you can add this butterfly here okay after that you want to add some clothes what you can do you need to just search for clothes you will get your shorts see you can add some shoes also see. so we have this dress okay after that uh, we can add some caps also so in the clothes section you will get everything okay even you can add the winter hat or you can add this hat okay so we now as you can see we have all these sprites like uh, sunglasses pants this butterfly dress hat okay now how we will give the instructions okay so how you will add your coding part so that coding part is called as instruction okay how we will add the instruction 
Suppose I want instruction for the ferry. Okay. See, without instruction, it will not work. So how you will add the instruction? Always we will start from events. Okay. So in the event, I want this is my first instruction. When flag is clicked. So when flag is clicked, so what will happen? Suppose I want the ferry position here. So what is X and Y position? It is minus 170 and minus 42. So how we will add this position? You need to just go to the motion. You will get your go to X and Y value. It means if I will take my ferry here, if I will click on front button, you will get this fixed position for the ferry. Okay. So for every sprite, we need to do the same thing. Okay, means when I click on glass, so again, when flag is clicked, so we want one fixed position for the glass also. Like go to X and Y. Same for this sun glass. When we will click on the flag, again, we want our X and Y value. Okay, same. After that, butterfly to same. When we will click on the flag, when flag is clicked, so we want X and Y value for the same. Same for the shots, when flag is clicked, so what the X and Y position 64 and 27. So you need to just go to the motion, take this X and Y. Same for this dress also, okay? So again, we will take this value and in the event, we will add some events. Same for hat also. When flag is clicked, so we want to add some position. So this is first part we did in all the spreads. Okay, after that, what we have to do now? Okay, so this is our second question. So what we want, suppose we need to click on any sprite. So we want one glide motion, okay? So how we will add that, okay? So first thing, we need to again add some events. Suppose for this classes, what event we can add now? When I click this sprite, okay? Means when I click on this sun glass. So what will happen? First, we want to go to the front layer, okay? So where you will get your go to front layer? Inside the looks, see this, go to the front layer. And what glide position you want, okay? Suppose I want, this here and see even you can reduce the size suppose i want only 80 it is also big so you can take it 50 see now it is perfect so what is the position for the sun glass and here we can take the show block also so if I will run, I will get this here. So uh, see what is the position glide minus 160 to 41, okay? So you need to take a glide. Glide means you can move from one position to another. And what is the position minus 160 to 41? See, if I will click on run, if I will click on this right, you will get that here, see? Like that, if we want the hat here. So even we can reduce the size for the hat also, we can write it 50. 50 is so small. So we can make it uh, 70. See, now it is perfect. So we want the hat position here. See, uh, this is perfect. So what we can do again, 
when this sprite is clicked okay means when we will click on the flag hat so what will happen again we want to go to our front layer and we can glide that okay so where is your go to front layer this and uh, we can take our glide so just go to the motion take glide now see if i will run if i will click on class see if i will click on hat you will get now we will do for the pan okay see same thing when this so where we want this pan near about here okay so what we can do now again when this sprite is split so where you will get that inside your event when the sprite is split so what will happen we want to go to the front layer so just scroll down we will get this front layer and what we want the next part glide motion means from one position to another see see we will do for this dress also so where we want this dress here like this okay so again when this sprite is clicked so what we want now we want to show that first so we will take the front layer and uh, we need glide position okay see after that i think we completed okay now see i want this class so we need to just click on that i want this hat this dress see pan okay so again i will show you hat now this is perfect so in this way we can create dress up para project and the next part how you will rename this project this is most important part so here you can write the name suppose dress up and how you can share your project you need to just click on the share button copy the link from here and you can share this link okay so in this way we can create a dress up project okay so if you have any doubt you can ask me in the comment box okay so thank you so much and please like share and subscribe our video if you want a latest update you can press your bell icon also okay so thank you so much have a great day